delay there in the front, the very beginning of the game, but definitely not a washout. But it could threaten you in the beginning of the game. So we'll be watching the timing of that. Look at those temperatures. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 60s. We've had overnight lows like that lately. So it's going to feel super different on Monday. Fall will be here. All right. Thank you, Mary Kay. Lost luggage could soon be a thing of the past. Last year, roughly 2 million pieces of luggage were lost on domestic flights. Now, as CBS 2's Chris Van Cleve reports, one of the nation's biggest airlines is betting on new technology that could help it lose fewer bags. The rate airlines mishandle bags, meaning they were lost, late, or damaged, is on the decline. But around one in every 300 passengers will have it happen to them. On this day, that passenger was Ron Mullenix. Ron, that feeling when... You and your wife are standing at the baggage carousel and everything stops and you're still a bag short. Yeah, you're disappointed, but we know it happens. Delta Airlines is spending $50 million to try to make that happen a lot less often. Installing a baggage system that puts a tag with a small radio frequency identification chip, or RFID, on a piece of luggage instead of a barcode. That should allow near real-time tracking of a suitcase as it winds its way through an airport's baggage handling system and is loaded onto or off of an airplane. American alerts flyers when their bags have been put on or taken off a flight. Alaska Airlines is running a test program to see if these digital baggage tags work better than the ink and paper barcodes that can smudge and wrinkle. Henry Hartevelt is an airline industry analyst. Every time an airline loses a suitcase, and can't get it delivered to you at the baggage claim, it costs them about $100 to bring it to your home or office or hotel. So that's a big expense that the airline would like to avoid. Delta's new luggage system will go online at 84 airports across the U.S. in the coming months. The airline believes it will reduce lost and late luggage by 10%. That's on the order of about 20,000 bags a year. Chris Van Cleve, CBS News, New York. Megan is here, kind of an audition going.